Officials gather in Mali to witness Colonel Simi Goita being sworn into office on Monday as the country's transitional president. His role comes after he led a second coup in nine months in May, and despite international condemnation of his power grab. On May 24th, Goita dismissed the transitional civilian president and prime minister, which caused former colonial power France to suspend its cooperation with the military. The African Union also suspended Mali's membership. The question now is when there'll be a return to civilian rule. After the first coup in August, the government installed pledged to reform the constitution by October and stage elections in February 2022. International powers are now awaiting to see if elections will be held then. Mali is key to the stability of the Sahel region, which is plagued by jihadist groups. Maintaining international partnerships is crucial for Mali, one of the world's poorest countries and whose security forces are thinly resourced.